Hey, it's day 274, the city of Khaibar with seven castles. Khaibar was an impressive city surrounded by beautiful castles. It had exactly seven castles. It was north of Medina. The Banu Quraiza Jews who had broken their agreement with the Muslims and helped the Meccan pagans during the Battle of Khandak, the Battle of the Ditch, had settled here. In order to destroy the Muslims, they were again hatching many plots. The Prophet knew that the Banu Quraiza Jews still did not behave well. He looked for some ways to fend off any threat or danger that might come from them. He gathered together his companions. They spoke at length about this. In the end, they reached a decision. They would surround and lay siege to Khaibar. They quickly got ready and set out towards Khaibar. Throughout the journey, there were many beautiful prayers on the lips of the Prophet. My Lord, I would take refuge in you from the worries of the future. I seek refuge in you from weakness, laziness, cowardliness, deaths, and oppressors. The word Amen from the companions in the army could be heard throughout the prayers of the Prophet. The companions proceeded with great courage on this journey to lay siege to Khaibar. Finally, one night at midnight, they set up camp in front of Khaibar. Again, the Prophet opened up his hands to Allah and prayed, O oh my Lord, who is the owner of the earth and the heavens, O oh my great God, who is the Lord of the wind and everything, it blows away. We ask you for the welfare of this city. We ask you for the welfare of everything that is in this city. And we take refuge in you against the evil things in this city. How good-hearted and well-intentioned the Prophet was. He was praying even for those people who had done unspeakably evil things to him. He desired only their well-being. The Jews of Khaibar were surprised when they woke up in the morning and saw the Muslim army surrounding the entire city. They were in total panic. They started running around in every direction to reach their castles. Once they were there, they started showering the Prophet and his people with arrows. It was a difficult time for everyone. The beautiful city with seven castles had become ugly with the ugly behavior of treacherous men. The Prophet and his companions kept asking for help by praying to Allah the Almighty.